Good day everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Radhamei P. Adulu from ABM 11YA-2P and I will teach you about commission. What is commission? Commission is an order from someone to do something and get paid. Commission have three types. Straight commission, salary plus commission, and graduated commission. What is straight commission? Straight commission is an employee only receive percent of the sale made. No additional compensation is given or guaranteed. So, my example tayo dito para sa straight commission. A detergent agent will receive a 16.75% commission for selling the company's new product. If the agent managed to have a total sale of 26,000, how much will the commission of the agent? So, ito yung process, paano iso? Yung straight commission. Commission equals to revenue times commission percentage. So, insulat natin yung given. Yung revenue natin is 26,000. Tapos yung percent, commission percentage natin is yung 16.75%. Iko-convert lang natin yung 16.75 sa decimal. Bago natin siya ipag-types. 26,000 times 16.75 divided by 100 is equals to 0 0.1675. So, pagka-times na natin, 26,000 times 0 0.1675 is equals to 4,355. So, ganun lang siya kadali. Here is another example para sa straight commission. Sir Manolo received 40% commission on the appliances he sells. If he sells a TV for 20000 a re refrigerator for 25000 and the audio system for 20000 how much does Sir Manolo make in commission? So, same process pa rin kung paano malaman yung commission natin. Yung revenue natin is tatlo. Um, 20000 para sa TV. Plus, 25,000 naman para sa refrigerator. Plus, 20,000 uli para sa audio system. Tapos, yung commission percentage natin, which yung 40%. So, pag add lang natin yung tatlo, then, i-convert natin yung 40% sa decimal. 20,000 plus 25 plus 20,000 is equals to is equals to 65,000 65,000 65,000 Tapos, i-convert natin yung 40% sa decimal. 40 divide, divided by 100 is 0 0.4. So, pag times natin, 65,000 times 0 0.4. Times 0 0.4. So, 26,000 ang commission ni Sir Menolo. Ganun lang kadali. And ito na yung pinakalas example natin para sa straight commission. Jezebel will receive a 5.5% commission for selling an iPhone for 25000 How much will Jezebel receive? So, same, same pa rin siya ng, ng process paano makuha yung commission. So, kukunin natin yung revenue niya which is 25000 25000 times yung commission percentage. 5.5%. Co-convert natin yung commission percentage 
sa decimal. 5.5 5.5 divided by 100 is 5.5 divided by 100 equals to 0 0.5 0 0.055 0 Yan. After nga, nagpag times natin yung 25,000 times 0 0.055 equals 1,375. Yan yung commission ni Jessup. So, ganyan lang kadali yung straight commission. So, natapos na natin yung tatlong example kanina sa full straight commission. So, pupunta na tayo sa salary plus. Ano ba ang salary plus? Salary plus is paid a small base salary regardless of performance along with the performance base and sentence known as commission. For example, so ito yung first example sa salary plus. Yaisha works at a company that pays her 3,000 pesos weekly and 6% of any sales above 2,000 pesos. If she sold her good worth 60,000 pesos, how much is her earnings? Ito yung susundan natin. Earning plus salary plus commission. So, ilagay natin, nilagay ko dito yung sa given. Ang salary niya is worth 3,000. Plus, yung commission, commission is 60,000 pesos. Tapos, ilalagay rin natin dito yung commission percentage, which is 6%. So, sulat rin natin dyan. Ang gagawin natin dito sa dalawa, is pagta times. Paano, mo, paano ko nakuha yung 0.06? Ang ginawa ko dito, pinag-divide pinag-divide ko yung 6% tapos yung 100. Ang ikakalabas niyan is 0.06. Tapos, itong dalawa, pag times nyo lang. Ang sagot dyan, 3,600 pesos. And here, ipagpa-plus nyo lang. 3,000 pesos plus 3,600 pesos equals 6,600 pesos. Yan yung earnings ni Yaisha. So, ito yung pangalawa. Mark have a monthly salary of 4,000 pesos as a car agent. If she managed to make a sale of 1 million pesos with a commission of 3%, how much is her his earnings? So, yun pa rin susundan natin. Earning equals salary plus commission. Yung salary niya is worth 4,000 pesos. Plus, yung commission, 1 million, yung commission percentage is 3%. So, itong dalawa, ganun pa rin. Ipagpa-plus natin sila. Pagpa-plus. Ayan. And, ito, itong 3%, uh, pinag-divide ko lang siya sa 100. So, ang lalabas is 0.03. Tapos, after that, ipag-times nyo ulit si commission at percentage. 1 million times 0 0.03, ang kalalabasan niyan is 300,000. So, pag-plus natin to and ito yung makukuha nyo. For, for 1,000 plus 300,000 is equals to 30,400 pesos. Yan yung earnings ni Mark. So, ito na yung pinakala sa salary plus. Louise have a monthly salary of 2,000 pesos as a car agent. If he managed to make a sales of 5,100,000 with a commission of 3%, how much is his earning? Same process, earning equals the salary plus commission. So, lalagyan natin yung salary niya worth 2,000. And yung commission is 5,100,000 at yung percentage which 3%. So, i-rewrite natin yung 2,000 and yung 3%, i-convert natin sa decimal. Ito na yung ikakalabasan yan. Um, 2,000, i-rewrite natin, plus 5,100,000 times, pag times mo silang dalawa, is 0 0.03. So, ang kakalabasan yung dalawang yan is 100,000, so, copy mo na naman yung salary niya, 2,000 plus 153,000 is equals to 
175,000. Ang earnings ni Luis is 175,000. Ganun lang kadali ang salary plus. So, natapos na natin yung sa salary plus. So, pupunta naman tayo sa graduated commission. What is a graduated commission? Graduated commission is a method of compensation for the sale. People where the commission earned as a percentage of sale increased incrementally with the increase in the sale volume. Our graduated commission is focused on performance. So, ito yung next example para sa graduated commission. Ezekiel works for a company that pays him 5% on the first 15,000 pesos sold. 15% on the next 35,000 pesos sold. And 20% on all sales over 50,000 pesos. How much is his earning if he sells 65,000 pesos? So, same. Minahana pay earning. Ang gagawin lang natin ang commission 1, commission plus commission 2, plus commission 3. So, 15,000, una niyang commission, and yung percent is 5, is 35, sa so second, 15, yung percentage, 50, 50, yung third commission, 20%, yung percentage. So, yung mga percent na yan, um, i- Co-convert lang natin siya sa decimal. So, 5 divided by 100 equals 0 0.05. So, yung 15 is equal, a convert siya sa decimal is 0 0.15. Yung 20 naman is 0 0.20. Ang gagawin mo dyan naman next, ay pagta times to, isa-isa. So, 15,000 times 0 0.05, ang ilalabas na is 750. Yung 35,000, 0 0.15, ang ilalabas niyan is 5,250, ang kakalabasan niya. Yung 50,000 naman times 20, 0 0.20 is 10,000. So, next na gagawin mo dyan sa tatlong to, ipagpa-plus mo lang. 750 plus 5,250, 10,000 is equals to 16,000 pesos. So, ang earning niya, Ang earning ni Ezekiel ay 60,000 pesos. So, next na example is, Madeleine sells appliances and she earned 15% on the first 15,000 pesos sold. 25% on the next 20,000 pesos sold. And 30% on the all sales over 30,000 pesos. If she had a monthly sale of 24,000, how much is his earning? So, next, paano natin siya solve? Yung first commission is 15,000. Tapos yung percentage, percentage na is yung 15. So, sasali natin siya. Tapos yung 20. Yung commission 2, mabot siya sa 24, kaya ilalagay natin siya, pati yung percent niya. Yung 30,000, hindi siya mabot sa 30, kaya hindi na, sa 24, kaya hindi natin isasama. So, ang next is, i-convert natin tong percent into decimal. 15 times 0 0.15 plus 20,000 times 0 0.25. So, itong dalawang to, gawin natin, pag-times natin siya lang. So, 15,000 times 0 0.15 equals to 2,250. Tapos, ang 20,000 times 0 0.25 is 5,000. So, pag-plus natin itong dalawa, yung 2,250 plus 5,000 is equals to 7,250 ang earnings ni Madeleine. Ayun. So, ito na yung pinakalas example natin for graduated commission. Caleb works for a company that pays him 6% on the first 15,000 sold. 20,000 per 20% 20 on the next 35,000 sold and 30% on all sales over 60,000 how much is his earning if he sells 65,000? So, same process pa rin. Ipagpa-plus-plus natin yung first, second, and third commission. 
So, ang first commission niya is 15,000. Umabot naman siya. Pasok pa rin siya sa 65,000. So, ilalagay natin siya 15,000 times yung percent niya, 6%. Plus, yung second commission, which is 35, pasok pa rin siya sa 65,000. 65,000 and yung second commission is 35 35 tapos yung percent niya is 20 yung third is 60 tapos yung percent niya is 30 so convert lang natin to So, na-convert na natin si percentage into decimal. Ang next natin gagawin dito sa tatlong to ay pagta-times si decimal kay commission. So, 15,000 times 0.06 is equal to 900 plus yung 35,000 times 0.20 is equal to 7,000 plus yung 60,000 times 0.030 is equals to 18,000. Ang next gagawin natin is pagpa-plus natin to para mukha natin yung pinaka-final na sagot. 900 plus 7,000 plus 18,000 is equal to 2,000. 25,900. Yan ang earnings ni ni Kalen. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you learned something about commission, straight commission, salary plus commission, and graduated commission. And I have a um, quote here for you. Just because we can't find a solution, it doesn't mean that there isn't one by Andrew Wiles. So thank you for watching. Bye!